Hi, this is Leon, and I want to talk about, I want to actually correct myself on the first video, Instinctive Fear. This is Instinctive Fear Part 2, and basically, um, I was utilizing concepts um, and comparing those concepts with uh the fear that I have accepted and allowed to exist within and as me. I uh, I uh utilize the concept of the dog wherein uh the dog did not have uh any fear whatsoever because of how the dog was moving and stuff like that and uh, how the dog was portraying itself. Uh, but basically, um, I was actually uh, utilizing uh, the personality of the dog and uh, comparing its personality with my personality instead of realizing that the dog's personality, you know, even though the dog uh, appeared to not be fearful of the water that would actually be a judgment because uh, I wouldn't know whether the dog even though of how the dog was was uh, uh, approaching the water I would not actually know whether that dog is fearful or not you know that dog may have been fearful <clears throat> but I judge his uh, the points, you know, his body movements and uh, stuff like that, I judge that. And uh, I compartmentalized it within my own body movements and stuff like that. Uh, so I was, actually I was actually judging that dog through the reflection of my own unconscious mind points of how I fear and you know my bodily movements and stuff like that so that in in essence is just a belief because uh, uh, any personality comparing another personality is, is not real it is simply a belief um, and um, also the point of instinctive fear um, uh, there is a point there is uh you know knowledge and information about uh babies being born and the only two fears that they have is um fear of loud sound and fear of falling so uh <clears throat> and that really is also knowledge and information which uh is, is simply based on personality points and and uh, information through you know the media or through um, uh, through research and stuff like that and through other peers that uh, that uh, I have heard it from because I actually heard that concept through peers at my I'm at the trade school that I was attending and so I used that knowledge and information and I made instinctive fear real you know, uh, and also the concept of instinctive fear, uh, it came up through a friend of mine, W, and uh, the W uh, had informed about instinctive fear and how we as humans have instinctive fear and how that is con will be considered a valid type of fear, which is also knowledge and information. Um, and um, I mean, all of it is really just personality based, uh, and the personality is simply a reaction uh, from and as all the experiences that one has experienced within their own life, and has constructed a personality, uh, um, which is really not real, because it depends on um, experiences that were inst 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 interpreted through one's own uh, livelihood.
So uh, I'd like to do self-forgiveness uh, for accepting and allowing myself to utilize knowledge and information separate from me and to uh, make that knowledge and information real. Uh, I forgive myself that I've accepted and allowed myself to compare uh, it's to compare concepts and and uh, ideas and um, and uh, symbols and personality points uh, which is not real um, I forgive myself that I've accepted and allowed myself to uh, believe that I am the personality and so within me being a personality accept myself and accept the instinctive fear as who I am um, <clears throat> so my self-corrective statement uh, would be uh, that uh, I am life here I am the breath I am one and equal as all life I am I am here within and as the physical um, more self-critical statements. I do not accept and allow myself to to define myself as the personality and to live as the personality. Um, I am not separate from um, knowledge and information. Um, yeah, that's, so that's basically. Uh, Oh, I am not defined by beliefs. Uh, I am not defined by knowledge and information. Uh, so, my self-creative application would be when and as I see myself going to a pattern of belief. I stop. I breathe. I realize that it takes my it, it, it needs my participation. Um, for for uh, beliefs um, to um, it, um, it needs my participation um, for beliefs to actually exist and for beliefs to define who I am as fear, as anger um, as knowledge and information as the mind, as the personality uh, I realize that this is not best for me, uh, and uh, it's not best for all. I stop my participation. Thank you.